Yep, it is that time again. Always sad to leave a vacation, a holiday, a trip. Today I leave Disneyland Paris. My very first time here in Disneyland Paris and yes, I am sad to go. So, bag's packed and I am just about to, to leave. Um, yeah, sad times. Yep. It is time to leave Disneyland Paris. What a trip. My first time. Like I keep saying, I will definitely be back to Disneyland Paris and enjoy more shows and whatnot. All the stuff that I kind of uh, missed and couldn't do and everything. But like I said, if you've watched a couple of days that I've been here, it was just a non rushed, just a nice and relaxed. A trip for me got on some amazing rides some things were familiar, some things different with a twist on it uh, compared to uh, kind of Walt Disney World etc but I had a fantastic time but yeah, today is a travel home so um, join me today in the travel home I'm so depressed, I know, I sound very depressed because of just that feeling I do not want to leave, however I need to so I am going to go get breakfast. I am at the if you haven't watched the vlogs and this is the first time watching me. I am staying at a Disney Share and Resort the Hotel and I'm just gonna go get breakfast, that's including my package. So I'm gonna go make most of that. It's half past nine in the morning just now. Check out is eleven AM here. So I'm gonna nip over, get breakfast, I'm gonna leave my bag here and then I'll come back for it. So I don't know how much I can record of breakfast, it's just a bit hectic with buffets and Travelling solo myself and everything that can get a bit awkward because I need to leave my seat and come back and all that stuff. So, yeah, a bit strange, but I'll see what I can do, what I can record. I'm going to go get breakfast and then I'll come back and then we'll get on with the day. My flight isn't until later on, about 10 past 6. So, I'm going to float around the resort, have a look at the resort, stuff that I've missed or couldn't see because I was going to the parks and having fun. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to get breakfast and I'll come back and then we'll have a walk around the resort. And then I've got the magic bus, uh, pay for the magic bus, the magic shuttle, uh, going back to from the resort to the hotel, uh, from the hotel to the airport. Uh, and then I'm flying with EasyJet up to Glasgow. So, yeah, let's, let's go home. <laughs> yeah, anyway, join me for today's travel home vlog. And, uh, yeah. I'll have some fun still, and then go on my way home. Let's go. Well, slight change of plan. I have just chapped by room service there. Room service? Or service? Yeah, they were saying service, so housekeeping. Um, I'm just going to leave just now, so I'm not going to go for breakfast. Well, I am going. I'm not going to go for breakfast and then come back, so I'm just going to take my bag out just now. I'm going to leave the room fully, go for breakfast, and then I'm out. So, I need drag my bag around but hey -ho, let's say uh, let's just leave just now it is uh, just after half past nine and we'll just get on with with the day from then rather than back and forth so I'm good to go here we go here's the bag and one last check at the room I don't know if you want to see a quick view of a beautiful day here That's why I'm going the chuck wagon. Lovely day here. There's flags going in the wind. Right. Let's go. Goodbye, Woody. Goodbye, Woody and Jesse. Yeah. Ah, oh, right. Don't want these, but these must. I've done the last checks. Let's go. Card out. Move the bag. Help. Upstairs. Goodbye, coffee machine that never used. Store for the last time. 
It's going to be hard to vlog and carry a bag, but I will try my best. Oh, the music started. Well, it was very busy, very busy in the chuck wagon. I was even 20 minutes just in the queue just to get a seat. And then once I got a seat, it was just pandemonium. But it is, I would say it is value for money. There's a lot of choice there, a lot of food. But I am out now. I had the scrambled eggs, sausages, beans. Good breakfast before my travel day. But now I'm going to walk around the resort see what cool things we can have a look at and see before finding out information about the bus and then going to the airport etc so I'm just going to have a chill day around the resort so let's walk around the resort and see what this resort has to offer but not in that sense but just like kind of cool things to look at and see and have a look at the theming so I've walked to the end I think of the resort I'm at Geronimo I see rooms Calamity Jane, Soaring Eagle over there. And you've got this. We'll have a look inside there as well. Nice relaxing area to sit in the gardens. You've got Butch Cassidy building there. Gonna have a look in here. I'm trying to lift my bag as much as I can because I know the sound is annoying. It's a nice little area in here. So I've walked down towards this this way here, so if you were to walk up that way that will take you to the, the central hub area where I was staying and the, the cafe and reception uh, so I've walked all the way down here Just try to take in as much as the the theming and the ambience That's yeah, it's a really, really nice room, really nice resort, theming, yeah, location's good like I said before, in my previous kind of videos, location has been great, not a long walk, I didn't use any other uh, transport, use the buses or whatnot, but walking was fine for myself. Right, let's see. What can I, else, well, where else can we, can we find? Well, we're exploring the resort. But, I don't know if that's like a big room itself. But it's an area called the stables. It's a lot of, kind of, plant beds going on. Not a lot growing just yet, but a few things growing. That was pretty different. Part of the Disney Paris biodiversity. Seen a sign there. Let's continue. Just look at the theming, look. I'll keep saying that now. And there Eve and there's a dance hall. I didn't get a chance to show my moves off on this trip. So I've just came out to the outside of the lobby. This is where the bus 
picks you up, I believe. I haven't seen one yet, but this is why I'm here. I've taken a picture of the information board. There's myself there, Disney Hotel Sheehan, and the pickup times. So there should be one. There we go, is that one there? Just on time. So that's the. Is that 10 past 11? I think I'll get the. Oh. 10 past 1. Just to be safe. I don't know how long it's going to take to get there. And then you've got security and everything else to go through. So I think I'll get the 10 past 1. Bus. Oh, I don't think that is it. I think that's it over there. That's. It looks more like it. That's a drop off. And that's Magic Shuttle, so it's that one over there. That's the bus I'll be getting later on. Just wanted to make sure that I knew where, where I was going and my bearings and times. So there's information boards. Up to, to let you know. But I'll put a picture of this up on the screen if you wanted to take a picture of it. Or you can pause the video. Talking about buses, I don't think I have even seen a Disneyland Paris bus to the parks. So I am here just waiting to see my first Disney bus. So I'm going to show you that once I see it, see what difference it is. Um, but yeah, just try to capture all these kind of moments that I never had a chance to because I'm only here for, I was only here for two days. So I'm just standing here waiting. This is the drop off point for the bus. The pickup point is only one bus stop for collection and it is very very busy just now. So yep, once the bus arrives I will show you what I see. Here comes my first ever look at a Disneyland Paris bus. That's another thing ticked off the list. Now, um, coffee? Someone say coffee? I think so. Now I got my coffee. And just standing outside the chuck wagon again, have a look. Music is off just now because I think breakfast and food is finished. I think everyone's way to the park because it does feel like the Wild West right now because the whole place seems abandoned. So I've got the whole place to myself. A bit more theming. Get to have a look at this. Don't know if I actually put fires on here or what, but... So cool, so I'm going to sit, well, find somewhere to sit and enjoy my coffee. And then, yeah, I have to get the bus. I really do feel like I'm just sitting having a coffee in the wild, wild west right now. But there's no music, which is just nice and relaxing. Music is off just now. And the bird's chirping away. I'm still thinking to myself, is it actually called Chuck Wagon? Or Chuckle Wagon. So why would that why would that be there? Not just for a window, is it? I haven't even actually looked the name properly. I did check, that is called the Chuck Wagon, not Chuckle Wagon. <laughs> so if you walk across, I'm gonna be nosy now, if you walk across the Chuck Wagon to where I am just now, directly opposite of it, you'll see a bridge that takes you to Hotel Santa Fe. I'm going to walk over and have a look at that hotel before I get my bus back to the airport. Oh, well, this is something different. I've walked through the resort to get to the front reception and it is very different to what I've, something I've, I've never seen before. It's like a motel kind of idea, but not a motel. 
theme, I don't know. Maybe I'm totally wrong. Got a letter McQueen up there as well. I'll show you what I mean, I'm going to walk back through and I'll show you what I mean, but look at that. That is pretty cool. That's what I'm saying, it's a very unique design. Look at that. <laughs> so, so different. I like it. I like it, it's different, it's quirky. You've got a tow meter there as well. You've got cactus and road signs and another great theme for a hotel. Well, I'm going to walk back to my resort, wait for the magic shuttle bus and then yeah, head back to the airport. I'm officially going back home, so I am flying with EasyJet and uh, yeah, it should be about an hour and a half it was an hour and 25 minutes, an hour and a half coming down from Glasgow to France, to Paris but yeah, I am going to miss this, this weather has been great and I'm going to miss Paris, just put my bag back down there Right, let's go get the bus to the airport. Just waiting for the bus. I couldn't resist buying some pins. Now, I'm not massively into pins, but just some souvenirs basically for my time that I've been here. So, the 30 year Disneyland Paris 2023, because I visited this year. I thought that was pretty cool, the Disneyland Paris pin. So, I got them as a memento. Reminder that I have been and had a great time. I'm just sitting here waiting for my bus. I'm going to move seats actually, I'm going to go to the other side and wait for my bus to arrive. So, if you are also looking to fly or going to be flying back with EasyJet, you fly into and leave from Terminal 2B. At Charles de Gaulle Airport. Now I don't know if this is mine. Yes, it will be. Here it is, the magic shuttle taking me home. I'll take me to the airport to then go home. Sad times. Sad times. One more look. And goodbye. <laughs> steps that I've done in the last two days. So that's my travel day. <laughs> my first full day. And then yesterday. That's crazy. 23,500. 22, 6 or that's just... I think that's more than World Disney World. <laughs> that's a lot of steps. Well, 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 we just stopped off at the Hotel Santa Fe. That's a, a better view that I could have got. Now just stopping at the Sequoia Lodge. That's been myself 
in Santa Fe, Hotel Santa Fe, and now Sequoia Lodge. Is that a hotel? Where are we So I have arrived at Terminal 2, that's my bus I came off of, I believe I need to go through these doors, turn left, go to a lift and go up to level 2 and walk round. Maybe it takes 5 or 6 minutes to go to Terminal 2B and that takes me to the EasyJet. So let's go see if that works out. following the signs that say 2B with the arrows on them so seems to work out okay so far It's actually very convenient and easy to find to keep following the arrows it says 2B and you'll go for a little walk maybe five six minute walk so that was pretty easy to find. I have found EasyJet at 2B. I'm going to try and see if I can get checked in, get a boarding pass and get through security. So I will see you all on the other side. So just through security. And look at that view you get. As soon as you put your stuff back on, this is the view. We get an EasyJet plane coming in. That is really cool. Look at that. Anyway, I better get moving because I'm still standing just at the back end of security. I'll wait till this plane turns. Look at that. Right. Let's go and chill before we get the plane. So I have made it through security and then the kind of secondary security with your passport, passport check, automated gates. So look at this, this is the gate. How cool does this look? You get to have a look at some planes. I can't see the planes just now because people have gone onto a bus, but yeah, really cool. So I think I've got another hour to wait, I've got to check just now, another hour to wait until boarding. So it's actually 25 to 6, so that should be 25 minutes until I board and then take off, hopefully, and leaves on time is 6.30. We are an hour ahead here, so hopefully gain an hour back when I go home, so yeah. Um, can't believe it's over, it's been an awesome trip, amazing trip. Of course I will recap at the end of the video um, my trip here at Disneyland Paris. It's been a... Uh, sorry, I was looking at my ticket just now, because... I think I might have a window seat. So yeah, I think it goes A, B, C starting at the windows A. I'm not too sure, it'll be good to get a window seat this time. Wait, was that like a big 
stuff like this, you can go, oh, I've got this cool. Glasgow Airport. Let's go get to my car. We can re recap on today and recap over the weekend. Yeah, glad to be back, but also sad. I kind of forgot where I parked my car for two seconds there. It feels like I've been away for a week. Don't know why. Well, that brings an end to my very first Disneyland Paris. A vlog series. It feels short and sweet but I also loved every second of it. It means I want to go back again and I do want to go back again but it might not be this year, who knows. I've got a lot coming up this year, a lot of plans coming up this year. Um, but yeah, today's today's trip was kind of seamless. So the Magic Shuttle, uh, I highly recommend that. Takes just over an hour though from my location, uh, Hotel Sheehan to get to the airport and then you just follow the signs to get to um, Terminal 2B so it does go, it stops at Terminal 1 and then if you want to go to Terminal 2 
you can stay on the bus and it stops there as well. And uh, for myself, I an easy jet. I went to uh, Terminal 2 and Section 2B. But yeah, all seamless. Uh, it was a great flight, no issues at all. Back home now and looking forward to my next adventure. So I have a lot of content coming up Walt Disney World, Cruise, uh, Universal, all these things coming up. So make sure you hit subscribe, hit the notification bell to remind you of the videos once they're uploaded and follow me on social media, links down below, so, um, yeah, uh, that's, that's, that's all I can say, hopefully you've enjoyed the videos, thank you for your support, thank you for watching all the way through if you have, and until the next video, I'll see you all then, bye bye.